Hello everybody. So a while back I made a game called Force Science and it was basically bad. At the upper levels it had some fun ideas because uh, it was all about wrangling data and that's not something most base building games do. But at the lower levels it was very opaque and nobody ever really got through the first 10 minutes and understood what was going on. Uh, certainly no one ever felt you know, excited to play it. Um, and the problem with it is that in most base building games when you start off, you start off with very very concrete ideas of progress oh, I just built my base, now I've got to go find some wood. Um, you know, that sort of stuff. You have a very simple progression that's easy to understand and easy to grasp. Um, I decided that the way to fix that in for science, if I decide to recreate it, is to use Unity 5, or Unity 4.6's new UI, which has a powerful feature to stick it into the game world in a very, very straightforward way. So here I've got these chemical notes, which some scientists created by doing a, uh, you know, experiments, and they did three experiments and they created some chemical notes, and these would be physical objects in the game world, like you can see here. But the key here is that these physical objects in the game world are my equivalent of resources. Each of these pages is its own little data node that has to be wrangled. And you've got to have that feeling. You've got to have a feeling where these papers, you've got to give them to someone. You've got to move them somewhere. And therefore, as you back off, they turn from papers into floating icons. But they still have a feeling that they're in the real world and attached to that desk. And if we wanted to transfer them over, we could. And as we continue to move away, they will just vanish entirely. So I think that this is going to make my early game a lot better, and it's actually compelling enough that I'm considering actually remaking the game um, with some of my more modern ideas uh, as to how it should work, and with some of Unity's more modern capabilities. Well, anyhow, I thought it would be interesting to show you that this is the sort of uh, the sort of thing I'm thinking of these days. Oh, and you can also do a lot of subtle things with this, like these are scattered. You can see how they're not all arranged nicely, and that is to tell you that they're notes right away. Um, if they weren't notes, if they were, you know, papers or uh, or you know, collated documents, they would be straight, and you wouldn't have any kind of confusion. You know, there wouldn't be any, any skewing. So there's a lot of really cool little details I can do with this. That's it.